Hi guys, welcome back to our channel. As you can see from the title of this video, this is a cook with me. Um, we are doing one of my family's favorite things, which is a crock pot macaroni and cheese. Um, I well, if you look at the, the thumbnail of this video, you can see all the ingredients that I have laid out, but um, I'm gonna go over them quickly and then I'm gonna pan down so we can just get started and you can see everything that I'm incorporating as that I as I'm putting it in um, so pretty much this video will be fairly quick um, my trusty helper Stephanie has already cut cut the cheese and well the Velveeta cheese all that other good stuff so we have everything squared away but one thing I wanted to show you all the main thing is this um, Campbell's cheddar cheese soup Focus. The rest of the stuff that's here. There we go. It is a cheese soup. I used two cans of this. Um, there was one time I was having a hard time finding it. I had went to like two different WalMarts. Publix didn't have it. Um, so I just happened to use the Fiesta Nacho Cheese one. As you can see, um, sorry if you hear the TV in the background. So that's that one. So you use two cans of either one. Um, the ingredients, I will leave the, the info for the ingredients in the description box below. Um, that way I don't take up time trying to do all that. So. I use two cans of that, especially if I can't find a big can. I personally haven't found a big can. I use mozzarella cheese, sharp cheddar cheese. I use, um, as you can see here, this is some Velveeta cheese that is cut up. I have a half a stick of butter. And this is my concoction I don't know if you can see it I don't want to spill it but you'll see it once I pour it in this is um, half and half and the cheese soup already mixed together by Miss Stephanie I'm gonna be using um, black pepper and I'm going to be using um, smoked paprika so those will be my ingredients and it's going to be amazeballs i am a macaroni and cheese connoisseur like i can eat macaroni and cheese every day like i'm not even gonna hold you up um but yeah let's dig right into it i'm gonna pan down so we can get started all right guys as you can see i have my three cups of uncooked macaroni elbow macaroni pasta already in here as you can see it's actually a good bit um i already had some so if i'm not mistaken i want to say that um this is pretty much a one pound box so i have that already in there i'm going to grind me some black pepper i love black pepper if you don't like black pepper you don't have to add it but i like it you'll see me adding it again at the end so we have that and then we're going to cut up our butter all over it's a little soft because it's been sitting out but we're just going to place it all throughout yeah for you all please make sure that <laughs> you keep yours in the refrigerator that way you don't have to worry about it being super soft on you when you're trying to do this so that part is done Now for our Velveeta cheese.
And now we are going to use, just pour in our mixture. As Tabitha Brown loves to say, and I love watching her, even though I am not all the way vegan, and I like vegan options, we're gonna pour it in there like so, like that, okay? And we're just gonna stir that around. Mix it in there very well, get everything nice and ooey gooey. And here's something I personally like to do. I like to sprinkle a little more cheese over the top. And here is where the, what did I say mozzarella? Why did I read this earlier and say mozzarella? But it's Monterey Jack cheese. So we're gonna put that on top. All right, set that to the side. Now, here we come again with our black pepper. for our smoked paprika. And I love smoked paprika as well, so I'm a little liberal when I sprinkle it on there. And there you have it. I'm gonna zoom in a little bit for you guys so you can see exactly what it looks like. There we have it. And now what we're gonna do, this will cook on low for three hours and we'll be back once it's done. All right guys, we're back. We are, um, we're three hours down the road and let's take a gander. Oh my gosh, look at that steam. Amazing, absolutely amazing. So this was three hours on low in the crock pot. Let me grab a spoon so y'all can see how ooey gooey delicious that looks. That is, that is absolutely amazing. Does that not look divine? Oh, the cheese. For those of us that uh, are lactose intolerant, I do apologize. Um, but yeah, we're going to be enjoying this. But again, the recipe it will be down in the description box. And until next time, we will see you all on Thursday. Also, if you have not subscribed to our channel, please make sure you do so. And we'll see you on Thursday. Bye.